Eight sharpshooters from around the world are taking over the Old West. And today they fired the first shots of their competition. Yeah, this is the second time Tucson has hosted a shooting World Cup event at the nearly 400-acre Tucson Trap and Skeet Club. Nine Your Side's Justin Shecker reports from day one of the competition. Today, Team USA's top trap shooters competed against the world's best. The women had their qualifying and medal rounds, while the top six men advanced to tomorrow's finals. The pressure is on for all of these shooters, but we found it's just as nerve-wracking for the proud parents. As Jake Wallace and Brian Burroughs shoot at clay targets flying nearly 70 miles per hour. Those are the guys to watch for. Yes. <laughs> for the Team USA. For, yes, USA. Definitely. Moms Terry and Sherry try their best to maintain the same mental focus. It's really hard to watch sometimes being the mom and keeping my mouth shut. <laughs> but the anticipation with every shot is nothing new for these marksmen's moms. It's very stressful. It's a very a long journey, a lot of competing, a lot of stress. Both their boys began shooting when they were 12. Our sons have grown up together shooting. They're best friends. They they were at the um, a training center together. They're like brothers, actually. And these moms have seen the dedication it takes for their sons to shoot against the best sharpshooters in the world. They live and breathe their sport. It's 24-7. Everybody else takes a back seat. It's their love of life. Yeah, the rest of us. We're to be seen and not heard. The Shooting Sport Federation World Cup continues this weekend. And it's free for the public to come watch. On Sunday, Tucson's very own 19-year-old Taz Gloria will compete here on his home range in the men's skeet shooting qualifying rounds. At the Tucson Trap and Skeet Club, I'm Justin Shecker. Kega 9 on your side.